A uh, single side band. Let's go to a hand band. That's what I'll do. Let's go to a hand band. Let's go to like 14.250. And single side band that run upper side on that band. Welcome back welcome back to my channel john here and you're on the sky one videos channel if you're new please hit the like subscribe and make a comment let me know um like i read everybody's comments man and i'll uh, do a comment back um <clears throat> today it's not about cars today is about radios this is a um this is a sanjin 909 x2 it's a shortwave receiver. It's um, it's new and sort of new. <laughs> they actually released this in a beta form and let people do reviews on it and test it. And then they they did a limited release and then they can't uh, stop that for a bit. And then now this is a final release. I'm not sure what version I got. If you know how to tell me how to check what version you got, let me know. But... Um, so Sanjin had come out with like this 909 for a while and I wanted to buy it and I never did. Um, then they came out with this newer version. The 909 was either black or, or like a white and I didn't really like either one. They came out with this one, it's gunmetal. It's a lot nicer. And uh, let me wait for this plane to go by. Okay. This is actually good that this is on right now. Listen. Under the age of 18, there were no trial patients that were previously exposed or had COVID. So she's talking. She's a doctor, and she's talking about that like this vaccine shouldn't be for kids. Um, you don't, you don't, you don't get that on like. See, anytime it goes through your computer, your network, all that stuff is all digitized. And it's just, voice to text, indexed, stored, categorized, reported on, and flagged. Um, so if the powers that be, you know who they are, don't like what you say, they just shut you off and that's the end of that. But with short wave, that's a little bit of a different story. You can get, um, you know, all sides of the story. So like what's going on there and um, like over in the Middle East, you know, you can hear both sides. Um, is there spin? Of course there's spin. There's spin every time somebody reports a story. There's going to be a, a spin to it. But that's like your... <clears throat> that's up to you to, like, separate, you know, the meat from the bone, so to speak. But anyway, enough of that stuff. Um, so, yeah, this this radio... Eight AM, FM, shortwave, and it's like all the way through on the shortwave. I don't, I don't have like just limited bands. Um, I'm not sure where the top is. I think probably 32 megahertz. Uh, but then I can go up to um, uh, aircraft band. You know, you can go up to aircraft, and you got memories, of course. I haven't figured out, like, with these memories, how to get them to scan the memories. If you have one of these rigs and you know how to do that, let me know. Because I don't, I don't know. I'd love to be able to set memories and have it scan. And I'm not sure if you can. But anyway, um, so this is bandwidth. That's the bandwidth. And it, I got it on auto, so depending on the, the signal... It's going to automatically select wide. See, it's wide right now. See it change. Um, let me go back to shortwave. Yeah, so that's AM radio. AM is actually medium wave. The regular AM radio reception on this thing is really sensitive. And it 105.5 FM, 10:90 AM, WTSB, Selma, Smithfield, North Carolina. So 
sorry, I get distracted. So I got a normal wide on the music. I don't want to get a copyright. <clears throat> you have the man bandwidth go from auto to, you know, I've been, I've been just running it in auto. It seems to be fine. It's got a lock so that it, you don't accidentally hit the power button or anything once off. Or you don't hit any buttons by mistake. I like the sound of the speaker on this, too. The speaker is... Um, I don't want to get a copyright. Who would have thought? Just about I 40 is stop and go between Rock Quarry Road and 70 Business. We have collisions Durant Road at Honeycutt Road and Saunders Street at Maywood Avenue. Otherwise, interstates and secondaries. The speaker State. sounds pretty good on it. This thing lights up here at night. You can see it. I, the, I wish the dis keypad. Um, I wish the keypad lit up though, but it doesn't. Um, so I still need a light, um, but this this lights up so I can see what frequency I'm on. And then, you know, you can plug in an external antenna, things like that. It can record. Never, I haven't done it. I mean, I just got this thing yesterday. Um, but it's a new, it's a new type of radio. So I wanted, um, I wanted uh, to show it off a little bit. Um, on FM, it's got the uh, RTS. So it'll, you know, says uh, like talk radio or the name of the song that's playing. Let's see. 105.1 You can see it Names what it's playing Um Yeah Let's go back to um Let's go to shortwave again So This is in kilohertz I normally think megahertz Because I'm modern old school is kilohertz so this is 5.8 megahertz or 5800 uh, kilohertz so let me go up a few and it's during the day so i should see if i can i can key in a frequency so the, the tuning right now it's in fast tuning I can hit the step and then go to a slow tuning I've got a uh, single sideband let's go to a handband that's what I'll do Let's go to a handband. Let's go to like 14.250. And single side band that run upper side on that band. Bands have been really weak lately. Well, it's quiet in this band. Good gracious. All right, let's try seven. Just go with it. And, uh, yeah, we, got, we got all kinds of flowers going over here for each 
Right where there was a station, there was a, a birdie or something. That's the lower side band. Not very loud. I got the volume all the way up. I mean, totally could hear it inside. It'd be no problem. Got a lot of birds, but. And I'm on the 7300 here, which is a little bit more fancy here, but uh, the radio is working, over. Uh, I'm 73 here. Okay, now there's not a lot of lows, but that's, uh, that's probably typical of that radio, but... Uh, it's good communication audio, uh, uh, Tom, over. So you can listen to ham radio, you can listen to aircraft, and AM, FM, short wave, oh, long wave. Which one? So the antenna is, um, is stainless. It's not uh, like those nickel plated, gold chrome plated ones. It's actually stainless, which is pretty nice. Well, what's the county uh, you're in? Uh, um, it takes four AA batteries. You can put in rechargeable batteries. You can see you can just, okay. you got to flick a switch and tell it to charge. Right now, I got the switch the other way. I got a tone. It's uh, alkaline. So if I do plug the adapter in, it just powers the radio. It doesn't try to charge the batteries. Of course, you cannot charge alkaline batteries. I have rechargeable batteries. They're very old. I don't know if I want to put them in here and charge it. Might want to test them on my little portable charger first, but I think they work, but they're, they've been dead for a while. And generally speaking, rechargeable batteries, if they've been dead for a while, I don't know if they're going to come back. But, um, yeah, I always wanted a little uh, portable radio like this. I've got, you know, I've got ham radio stuff too, so it doesn't have to be my primary. But <clears throat> sometimes at night I like uh, listening to uh, some shortwave stations where, you know, stuff in my room i can't really hear it in my bedroom so anyway uh if you have any questions on this this again this is the 909 x2 by sanjin and um my opinion on it i think it's pretty cool radio 260 bucks yeah i think it's probably worth 260 um i wouldn't want to go much more than that um i don't really see you know they when they first came out they were a little bit more expensive than that i don't know if i paid 300 250 bucks sounds about right right now with inflation and all and it sure looks great um no handle on it or anything like that so it does come with a case though a nice little like leatherette type case and uh, it comes with a external antenna that you can like hang across something and plug it in but i was using it last night and this whip antenna actually worked really well um, oh, and I was wondering about, uh, you know, does it get like CB radio? So let me put in 27 point, like 185 or something. And switch it to AM. Down to the Super Bowl. Maybe I'll hear someone down there, right? So I have a squelch, so I can set a squelch on it. Um, so yeah, like you could you could leave it on a CB channel, and um, what is what is channel 19? Is it is it 195 or 205? I don't remember. Um, but yeah, you could set a squelch on there.
And of course, you know, I can go up to like uh, 385 single sideband. Let me turn this, put this on. Uh, Squelch works on single sideband too. That's kind of neat. Let's go lower side. I guess I should have done this review when the bands were open. I mean, we had a solar flare or something. It's been dead quiet. I noticed that on my big rig because when this thing, I got the ship notice and I knew it was coming, I, I put on the big rig and I, and that's when I laughed. I said, oh, it's like really bad band conditions. I mean, it's not bad. I, I was able to work in Europe and stuff on, uh, on 20 meters, but they weren't all that strong. So, um, yeah. Plus, you know, comparing that antenna to that antenna up there. There's a bird up there watching me. It's really not fair. I could hook this on that antenna. That'd be interesting to see what I hear. Hook this on the beam. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so it's pretty cool radio if you're into shortwave or you want a nice uh, uh, FM radio, um, portable radio. It's, uh, it's pretty good. AM is really good. The, the sound quality is decent, so... Um, I think it's go back in and the here. great rising of Assyria. Porque no la la inconforme muñeco, sí, por favor. Traders, Bali Convention and Visitors Bureau, and uh... well, I get a lot of noise from the house. God, I can't play music too long. God says, just do what I told you. Ellis, our world is full of distractions. It's time to focus on the truth of God's word. On the air for over 40 years, Pastor Ellis eats and breathes the Bible with steadfast faith. He believes in the good news that is Jesus Christ. So that's Dinero. Raymond C. Ellis. Saturday mornings at nine. Normal. It's time to learn. It's time to music. worship. It's I like the sound of it in uh, mu Ellis. music mode. guys know like signals come in at night on shortwave so <laughs> i'm doing this at uh, 5 30 after work so anyway uh thanks for watching if you have any questions or you want to see something on it let me know again i don't, I don't know what version that is i get maybe in this info button i don't know Yeah, I don't know how to check what version I get. Because there was talk about different software versions on these radios. But, uh, yeah, I just got it. So, uh, yeah, if you got any questions, let me know. All right, later. Bye.